How's it going guys, Phil here, and this is a review for the Ovaria Soldering Iron. You will receive the soldering iron, a tube of solder, and five additional tool tips. A tapered tip, a knife tip, a wide tip, a narrow tip, and a beveled tip. The soldering iron comes pre-installed with a medium pointed tip. The soldering iron is about the size of a pen and measures 7.5 inches long. It has a rubberized grip where you hold the iron, and it's rated for 110 volts and 60 watts. At the end of the iron is a dial for adjusting the temperature of the tooltip from 200 to 450 degrees Celsius. This is useful if you work with different components and solders. The power cable on the iron is about 5 feet long. The amount of solder in the tube is about 3 quarter ounces of 6040 tin lead 2% flux solder with a 1 millimeter diameter. The coil inside can be dispensed from the tube by feeding the tip through the opening in the end and pulling it out as you need more. The tube also has a clip on it for your tool belt. To change the tips on the soldering iron, use some pliers to loosen the metal nut on the iron. Then remove the old tip and install the new tip before tightening the nut again. So here I'm going to start with a pretty low temperature of 250 degrees Celsius. I'll be soldering these two wires together. So I've already brought the iron up to temperature and tinned it with a bit of solder. Now I'll heat up the wire joint and carefully feed some solder onto the wires and let the wires melt the solder, not the iron. Overall, the soldering iron is easy to use and adjust to temperatures. The tips are also straightforward to change and the unit works well. I hope you enjoyed this review. You can ask me any questions in the comments. I'll put a link to the product in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and join me next time.